Hello everyone. In this session, I'm going to teach you what you mean by translation and how to translate an object with reference to a vector to its corresponding image by the help of mathematical application GeoGebra. Translation. Translation, it is it is isometric transformation. That means uh, there is change in the position but not the size. In translation, the main component uh, is the vector which, dis which displays the object to get the image. For that one, let us consider a triangle ABC with the vertices a minus 4 comma 1 b minus 5 comma minus 2 c minus 1 comma minus 1 and if this triangle this triangle is displaced by a vector that is d vector in the given direction then the respective image will be a prime B prime and C prime that is a prime equals to 1 comma 0 uh, B prime equals to 0 comma minus 3 and C prime equals to 4 comma minus 2 so see the figure over here there's no change you can see there is no change in the size of the object and the image also, sorry, the image so found with respect to the object. But it is being displaced by a vector that is known as the translation vector or we used to call it as displacement vector also. Translation is also considered as the displacement because over here the object is being displaced by a vector to a certain direction. Now I'm going to discuss on the translation and make you understand what is the translation um, by plotting the triangles and the respective vectors to get the image. Okay, first of all, let's draw a triangle ABC with the given vertices. Means ABC is a triangle, the coordinate of A is minus 4, comma 4. B is minus 7 comma 1 C equals to minus 2 comma 2 and it is being displaced by a position vector DE um, let's switch properties value name and value ok over here you can see the value of the position vector it is 5 comma minus 2 now we are going to displace this triangle ABC with, with respect to this vector for that one what we need to do is We need to translate by a vector this point this triangle with respect to this vector then that is V point is DE that is V Let me write its name also, right? The value also, name as well as value. That is five comma two. Let me change its properties, a color. Make it the red one. Similar, this point as also red. 
is C as well so red and the triangle this triangle we could write as a notes of red then similarly I'm going to contain this object a prime B with B prime C with C prime For that one, put a style and this one arrow. So the arrow similar with this one. We change this properties in open line or liquid line. This one, this has the liquid line. This has the now what you can see is if we change this position vector then the object will be also uh, the image point will be also changed and we can see over here there is no change in the size of the image with respect to the object but it is being displaced for example, just see here, uh, the displacement vector is 4, 3. It means that for the coordinate of A, or it's better to say the B, is clearly over here, the coordinate B is minus 7, 1. And if uh, this point is displaced by this translation vector, uh, 4, 3, then uh, minus 7 will add 4 to get minus 3. And the one will add three to get four. It means its coordinate will be added with the component of the vector to get the image point. Now I'm going to demonstrate uh, the object point and image point in terms of the coordinates. For that. Uh, I need to go to this slider button text. Okay, let me type over here. Uh, o B Z E C T object. Then I N A Z E S image object and image. first object is this point A. First let me write A. Object is A. Copy this one. Control C. Control V. This is A prime. A prime over here. Then enter. B object is B B this is B prime object is B prime over here Enter. similarly C and then oh, sorry I forgot to write C C over there then image is C prime that is C prime done now we'll see over here there will be change there will be change in the position okay we'll see here if I change the position vector over here we can see changes in what the coordinate also the coordinate of the image but the object when has been fixed okay similarly it means uh, the image is obtained by adding uh, the x component of object with the x component of translation vector and y component of object with the y component of translation vector to get the respective image 
The next thing is that if you keep this vector, uh, that means the translation vector as constant, then if you change the object one position, then there will be change in the image also. Okay, this much for today. I'll be continuing this transformation class in the next video too. Till then, bye everyone. Please you can put up the comments so that I can make so that I can make my upcoming videos more interactive. Till then, bye everyone. Have a good day.